convex mirrors have their curvature facing the other way. Now, with a lot of times, like spoons or something, you could do both. You could look at the side, the curvature is facing you, turn it, and you could look at the other side. Okay? But there are sometimes mirrors that are specifically convex, and then the, some that are specifically meant for concave. Okay? So, uh, with this kind of mirror, you have the center is here, and the focal point is here. Then the light rays come, and instead of going bouncing this way, going through the focal point, they bounce this way. It, it looks like it's coming from the focal point. Okay. It goes like that, you see. So instead of bouncing inward through the focal point, it bounces away and seems to be diverging from the focal point. It seems to be coming from the focal point. And then if you go like this, bounce the middle, it's going to bounce like this. It's going to be seeming to come from here. So where does the uh, mirror form an image? Well, the light rays seem to be emanating from this point. And notice with this one, it doesn't matter where I am. You know, I could be here, I could be here. It's going to be the same effect. It's always going to be a real image. Uh, sorry, it's always going to be a virtual image, but it's going to be upright and it's going to be smaller. So, virtual, upright, and diminished. Okay? And it doesn't matter where I am. So, if I'm here, I go like that, I go like that, I go like this, I go like this. Okay? And it's going to be... The image is going to be here. So if I get closer, 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 the image gets closer to me. If I get farther, 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 the image gets farther, farther, farther. Okay. So uh, let's take this. Now you can see with this one, the concave mirror that we used, the back side was coded, so it's specifically meant for just to be concave. And then this one that I'm going to use for convex, the back side is coded. And so the side that we're facing is meant to be the convex side. So, so pretty much you can see it's always diminished, it's smaller than I am. And um, it's virtual and it's upright. Okay. Uh, a lot of times these kind of mirrors are used in stores and shops. They put them in the corner so they could have a good view of everyone and uh, they could see what's going on in the store. Okay, so this is the, the optics of uh, ray diagramming and the optics of concave and, uh, concave and convex mirrors. Thank you.